All right, Mr. Fennick, uh, tell us a little about why you're here in Vegas today. Um, well, I'm obviously I'm here to be honored by the WBC and Hublo fan as one of the, uh, the 12 legends, so um, it's an honor. And, uh, I'm excited, but I'm more excited about what's happening because of this and the, the pension fund that the WBC are putting together for these guys who need uh, who need some help, so it's great. So how does it feel to be you know included in this group, and especially how does it feel to, to be uh, with someone like Mike Tyson, who you're so close to? Like I said, it's, um, sometimes you wake up and you don't believe it's happening, but yeah, it's, it's, it's an honour, like I said, um, to be some little guy from Australia who you know, rolled his sleeves up and worked hard and to achieve what I've achieved. I'm, I'm very, very honoured to, to get these uh, accolades after my school. Now, of course, you, you train Tyson a little bit. Um, do you see kind of a parallel in, in, in your lives, the way you, know, you kind of started on the wrong side of the tracks and then have both uh, kind of changed your image? We've done, we've done plenty of things that are similar, and um, I think that's why we're such close friends today, that we uh, we understand each other, and um, yeah, we have most respect for what he's done in his life today. Right. And uh, what about the, the guy you're most closely associated with, uh, Zuma Nelson? Uh, how's your relationship these days? Well, I, I love the guy. I think he's one of the greatest, uh, you know, maybe the greatest African fighter of all time. So. Um, I can only ever say that um, you know, uh, without a Zoom at all, there might have been no Jeff Phoenix. So um, you know, okay. uh, Zoom is one of the greats. All right. So what have you been doing uh, lately since your your time away from the ring? Oh, well, I've got three kids, 16, 18, <laughs> and uh, 22. Two girls and a boy. So busy being a dad. And I've got my own wine company uh, in Australia. I do. I enjoy myself. You know, I've got some great friends that are here with me from Australia, so I'm uh, just enjoying myself. All right. Then last question for you. Uh, you know, who are some of your favorite Australian fighters now? Uh, Daniel Gill, a young kid who I, I started as an amateur and I helped him and uh, you know, I started him off. We've got Billy Gibb who's a world champion yeah. as well. Uh, yeah. We've got Victor Chinin who's still out there who will fight anybody. So look, Australia, Australia's healthy at the moment. We've got some other young up-and-comers, so boxing's pretty good in Australia. Really. Are you familiar with Rocky Jerkic? He works with uh, Jeff Mayweather, a guy I work with. He's a uh, 5-0. and He's training here with Mayweather. Yeah, I've heard of him, yeah. I'm not too familiar, but I've heard the name, yeah. All right. uh, well, thanks for your time and uh, congratulations.